during Wednesday's installment of Piers Morgan, uncensored, the talk TV host debated King Charles Ives' decision to evict the Duke and Duchess of Sussex from Frogmore Cottage and move Prince Andrew in. The cottage had been the couple's UK base since 2019 but Piers backed the King's move to put his role as monarch above his instinct is as a dad to Prince Harry. Piers began by telling viewers the King had sensationally evicted Harry and Meghan from Frogmore Cottage and reportedly offered the home to his brother Prince Andrew. The Duke and Duchess of Sussex were given the cottage as a wedding gift but they have now been left without a home in the UK after Buckingham Palace served them with eviction papers. A spokesperson for the couple confirmed on Wednesday. We can confirm the Duke and Duchess of Sussex have been requested to vacate their residence at Frogmore Cottage. Piers was joined on his show by journalist Kevin McGuire and historian Tessa Dunlop to debate the King's bold move. BBC frustrated with Ken Bruce as Reason Show axed early emerges Kevin stated, there's a new sheriff in town and has going to be known as the Iron King. Piers asked Kevin, is this the act of a king, not a father? Has he basically put his new status as the monarch and the interests of the monarchy and his role as king above what maybe his instinct is as a dad? The associate editor of The Mirror replied, it may be he believes in tough love. It is pretty sensational as you say, Kevin added. I thought he would try and find common ground to try and build bridges and get some peace. But this is, a case of, if you are going to go to war with me then I am going to fight back. The King's coronation is just months away and invitations are due to be sent out in a matter of days. I would put good money now that there will be no invitation heading on its way to California, Piers added. Piers Morgan reacts as Charles evicts Meghan and Harry from Frogmore, update Piers Morgan clashes with royal guest as King Charles gets political, latest Piers Morgan praises Rishi Sunak in brutal jibe at Johnson and Truss, update, he later added, there is a tipping point for anybody no matter how much Charles may want to be a good dad, Prince, William, I am old, was utterly incandescent after, Spear came out. Apparently this decision was taken the next day after the book came out. Harry's tell-all memoir Spare was released on January 10 and it detailed a personal account of the prince's life growing up in the British royal family. However, Tess felt it was not a good move for Charles to make a decision in haste as she defended Harry. Should Meghan and Harry lose their titles, Here's how you voted in blistering poll Meghan Markle and Prince Harry dropped further bombshell revelations against the royal family this week as Meghan's new podcast got underway. And Express.co.uk readers shared their views on whether the couple should lose their royal titles. What was the result of the poll? Find out here. She said, I think given the coronation is weeks away and we want our monarchy to look global, to look like it is an institution which understands what redemption means, I think the timing is unfortunate. I think the optics of asking Uncle Andrew, the disgraced Duke, to move in are deeply unfortunate and I would question whether this is the right decision at the right time. Prince Andrew has always strenuously denied any allegations made against him regarding campaigner Virginia Jufrey. Piers Morgan, uncensored airs on weeknights at 8pm on Talk TV.